Today we're going to be adding the OG Alex Hormozzi captions to our videos, much like what you're seeing here. Now, we're going to be using a software called CapCut, which is free on your Mac and PC, and you don't have to type out the captions, they're auto-generated. We're also going to be adding the pop-ups, and we're also going to be doing the animations and the emojis. So let's get started. So after you install CapCut, you want to create a new project like I just did. Import your videos and audios and all that. I have mine here. We're going to be literally editing the audio you just saw, I mean the intro. All right, so we're going to drag and drop our clips onto our timeline. I filmed the audio and visual separately. So we're going to drag both. So command plus to zoom in. And I'm just going to quickly sync the two. So if we just drag it like this, you can sync the two pretty well. All right, command minus to zoom out. All right, and then I kind of start talking here. So if I highlight both, command B highlight these two, delete. All right, let's get started. So the first thing you want to do is you've noticed that this video is horizontal and say you're editing short form, short form is usually vertical. Okay, we've got our reference video here, by the way. So short form is usually vertical. So we want to change the aspect ratio to nine by 16. So click ratio there, nine by 16. And now it doesn't fill up the entire frame and we want it to fill up the entire frame. So what we're gonna do is we're going to select this top one and make the scale super, super big. <laughs> Damn, every time I look at myself, I think, gosh. <laughs> All right, enough. So now what we want to do while we have it here is if the audio is really trash, and I don't think this one is because I'm using a USB microphone, what you can do if I use my phone for this or the audio of the video editing is really trash, you can click normalize loudness and reduce noise. I wouldn't use enhanced voice. It, it sounds really bad. But yeah, normalize loudness and reduce noise are often good things to use. Afterwards, we need to add the fonts, right? And the fonts that Alex Hermosi uses are Montserrat Black or the bold font. When he used his OG fonts that what he's recognized for. Now he uses all sorts, but we're gonna use these two. So if you don't have these fonts installed in your computer, make sure you go to search Montserrat Black free download or the bold font free download. Go to fontsfree.net, click on it and click download now. And then now it would pop up here. Just open it and click install. Uh, I don't really have to do that because I already have it installed. I'm not going to replace it. And yeah, you can do the same with the bold font. But those are the two fonts he predominantly uses. And once you've installed it on your computer, you need to close CapCut and then open it again so it can update and refresh. So now let's actually add the captions. So text, auto captions, create, it says Chinese. I wonder how they know that. <laughs> but it will sense whatever language I'm speaking in, so don't worry about it. So just create captions, shouldn't take too long. Perfect. Now, what we're gonna do is say this is too long for us, right? Say we want to make, today we're going to be on one caption and be adding the OG on a different caption. Here's how you can separate it out. So if we go into captions and then say we want to separate these captions, we're going to and be adding. So if you go between where you want to split, go delete, enter, and it'll become a new caption now. So the problem when you do that is that CapCut's not very good at syncing the audio when you do that. So if you go command plus and you zoom in and you listen, adding adding b so b actually starts here but as you can see the caption is here which is not ideal so we have to manually for every caption do this whole process to sync it up with the audio and usually i start it from here today we're gonna be adding perfect all right so you can do that for the entire process and also you can see some spelling mistakes so you can just edit those but we, what we're going to do, the good stuff, right? What are you here for? So go to text. Go find the font you want to use. Now, Montserrat Black. Well, bam, I have it under recently used. But if you don't have it under recently used, you have to scroll, 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 scroll. Find it. 
and then and then click it but we're not gonna we're not gonna waste your time so monster it black boom and we're gonna go font size 16 boom case capitals boom then we are gonna scroll down stroke boom and then glow boom i think it looks pretty good we're gonna drag it all up and we're gonna have a watch we're gonna admire our work today we're gonna be adding the og all right perfect now what things does he do he adds a few things to his videos as you can see pop up here and colors and angles when i was single i actually ended up eating okay so what we're gonna do we're going to be doing angles first so remove apply to all because it's not consistent amongst all captions we're gonna edit single captions and now we want to rotate this just click this and drag it like that perfect and then say i want to change the color of the word today we're going to click double click today highlight it go to color and either change it to yellow or green and i've saved you so much time boys so if you want yellow this is the hex code f f f d zero three if you want green zero zero f f zero zero simple simple hex code memorize those hex codes write it down pause the video and, and get it down all right so let's say we want yellow now say we want to add uh, emoji boys he adds emojis so cute look at that emojis boys here's how you do it so we want to go to add text default drag we're gonna zoom out so we can drag this for the same length as our first caption we're gonna make sure it's the same length then we are going to delete the word default and go to control command spacebar for the emoji keyboard on the mac and then calendar emoji because it makes sense make the font somewhat like that rotate it so it's the same angle as the caption drag and drop doesn't look exactly the right angle boom done all right simple boys and then oh i'm gonna make it slightly bigger I think that's good all right and if you don't have the emoji keyboard because you don't have a mac what you can do you can just go calendar emoji and then bam Control c Control v you should have the same effect i've heard that sometimes on windows it doesn't work like that but i guess you have to do a png pop-up which will which i'll actually show you soon all right and the other thing he adds he sometimes does this thing where as he speaks the words I get bigger only from my accountant when he looked at my financials he was like is this a mistake you it doesn't show in that particular clip but i'll just show you anyway so if you go command minus so we want to make the og big when we say it og o so when i say og here say i want og to be big when i say it. so command b to cut the caption when i say og and then click on the second half of it double click the og make it slightly bigger say 18 boom it's slightly bigger now you're adding the og alex homer put cool all right that looks good now we want to do pop-ups because he does a lot of pop-ups lunch and dinner 10 times a week yeah that makes sense and i like chipotle yeah just like that chipotle logo let's say we want to pop up alex homozy what are we going to do we're going to search alex homozy and we're going to save this image now if we want to just add it to our video we can literally just go we're bam we're bam we're gonna be adding the o okay it will go we're bam here G alex Homer. and then scale and then we're bam drag but if we want to do it with no background here's how you're going to do it so if we go to if we search up remove background remove.bg and just drag and drop this here and then click download 
but bam, we have it sorted. Drag and drop it onto our timeline. There we go, boys. We have Alex Homozy. There we go, team. I need to stop using boys. We've got to be inclusive these days. Nothing against women. It's just that that's how I talk to my friends, I guess, even my female acquaintances. All right. Let's match it up. And there you go. The Alex Hormozzi captions to our videos, much like. So yeah, you do this process for the entire length of the video. And that's, that's pretty much it. So thanks for watching. My name is Junius. I help you make and strategize educational content. And if you'd like more content like this, consider subscribing. And I have playlists kind of organized like an online course. If you want to learn how to do more things and strategize your content and all sorts of things like that. So yeah, overall, thanks for watching. I hope this was helpful. Uh, see you in the next one.